quarterfinal action at the U.S. Open. We're live now. That's Nick Suriano. The uh, tennis we've seen Nick in a long time. Taking on Cooper Flynn in the blue, Nick in the red, and the gold singlet, just like his uh, gold-tinged hair from the sun. Suriano taking ground. Flynn, edge of the mat. Under hook on the left side for Suriano. Flynn pivots and drives his hips. They go hip to hip and it's one point for Flynn. We'll see if that holds up. It does, confirmed. So Flynn with the 1-0 lead over Nick Suriano. A two-time NCAA champion, first with Rutgers, then with Michigan. Suriano again taking ground. Flynn circles back to the center. Some good fakes by Suriano. This is uh, every match is do or die. Thomas Gilman has accepted his bid to Final X. Final X is a best two out of three wrestle off to determine who makes the world team. Snap go behind. Suriano, quick strike. On that shot from Flynn, the re-attack from Suriano gets it done, and now he takes the lead, working on a bent leg. Can he bow and arrow? Flynn will he trap it with a figure four. Good defense from Flynn. Restart, still two to one, one minute, 15 seconds remain in the first period. by Titan Mercury Wrestling Club, also with the Southeast RTC out of Virginia Tech, where he goes. Front headlock, and they circle. It's going to be grounded. Nick Suriano appropriately with the Sunkissed Kids Wrestling Club. So no score on that last, exchange, last exchange. Still two to one, 32 seconds remaining in the first period here. South Point in Las Vegas. Suriano staring straight ahead, fakes. For a little touch and go, big snap. Flynn drops down, comes back up. Suriano just so good positionally. Flynn runs out of real estate, and it's another point. Clock's ticking away. I might have missed uh, a couple seconds of that. Zeke Jones. Head coach of Arizona State in the corner with Nick. Mark Perry. That was Suriano's corner now. Get a nice towel down. That looks like a hotel towel. Classic move. Jared Freyer in the corner. Ethan Aguigui, I believe, also. For Flynn. Air Freyer also has got some, some coffee from head coach Tony Roby. That was happening in the corner. Back on the mat, though, the second period is underway. Also in the sidelines, looks like Spencer Lee getting a little scouting done. Not sure if he's wrestled yet. I'm guessing he already wrestled and has come off the mat. He's wrestled for a grand total of like 70 seconds in two matches. Suriano, this one looks to go the distance. As Flynn gets cautioned, passivity. Suriano, the three seed. Lee, the two seed. So Suriano and Lee set up for a collision course. In the semis, one seed is Zane Richards. Yeah. 
Arm drag attempt by Flynn. He's on the clock. He needs to score in the next 10 seconds. Or Soriano will take a 4-1 lead. They're trying to get a front head. Soriano just so strong for this weight class. He's wrestled up at 133 in college. I think just one year, was down at 25 for the rest. Flynn's a 125 pounder. But Suriano, visibly a little larger. 90 seconds remain, that point, for the passivity clock. Goes to Suriano. So four to one. And once again, Suriano relentless with the pressure. Flynn runs out of room. He gives up another point on the step out. Suntan Nikki is up five to one. Fifty seconds to go. Flynn really hasn't had much in the way of success with shots. Goes for the front headlock off the re re attack, but Suriano wouldn't budge. Flynn drops down. I think he was worried about maybe giving up more, being in an awkward position with Nick having a body lock, maybe. But either way, that, that two for the takedown makes it 7 1. 37 seconds to go. Flynn needs a home run these waning seconds. Looking for attack, but defensively, Suriano is world class. He's placed in several ranking series tournaments recently. Competed at the World Cup when it was in Iowa City in December. And Flynn shoots at the end. Suriano pushes him off, then goes for the handshake. But that's it, 7-1, dominant win. Suriano gave up an early step out, but then all Nikki with the sun-kissed hair for sun-kissed kids. On to the semis, and no, that's Spencer to take the mat now.